So this is me currently right now and in this video I'm going to show you the sort of things I do to stay fit literally for my gym session, my football session and plenty more you know this is basically going to be a day in my life keeping fit Like always before my sessions, I like to do it like a quick warm up. Then from there, I get into some sort of heavy lifting, like weight lifting. On here, I'm basically just focusing on building my strength, first of all. So I'm gonna build my strength, build that strength, load the weight up, and just keep doing it. So I'm gonna focus on doing five reps to my max five times. The good thing about some of these workouts is that it also reduces the chances of me getting injured. So they're really good for injury prevention and during this festive period i also look to build that muscle capacity at this stage i'm focusing on some speed training and at the same time some explosiveness so these are the sort of things i do i look to repeat each exercise for about six reps so i do six reps usually three um, three times So this exercise is quite good for my speed as well and my full body control, balance, stability. So this is why I do this sort of exercise. Point, I've just finished my gym session. So now I'm just going to play a bit of football. So with my football, again, I look to just train for about 45 minutes top let's walk at the first touch anyways let's move on to some dripping now Yes, my people, now we're gonna go on some agility. Let's go!
I can't keep up with him. Agility, definitely a nine out of 10. Moving on, some speed drills. Speed for me is my biggest strength. Yeah, look, I'm in line with the stars. I'm in sync with the earth. 10 toes deep, flower child from the turf. Ooh. this hello yeah yeah this is LGS yeah yeah I subscribe too have you subscribed make sure you subscribe my people to finish up the session we're gonna do some shooting I never switch sides like even when I die I'm a ride for the squad let of ties in the hearse I've been on a vibe kind of hard to describe I'm in between I'm good and it's fine but I'm tired of the grind then I come alive in the night to realize I'm in the middle with a time of my life I never so packed for the stack never lied on the back got a bag from the way that I write it Queen looking Tyson do that I survive doing 80 to the house then I hit it to the sky change haters on a tirade talking to the crib and the face be still like that hate stuff fade we all with the same we all want a meal in the safe I want to live like I'm trying to light me trail spill from my lips feel big from the bit take a sip till I pass out try and get grip but it don't make sense cause you can lose life on this fast route yeah turn thoughts to a cash cow i might flip that to the glass house i don't need the accolades i'm in love with the chase i just want to eat save a spot at the table beast with the slap hit myself on the map you long with the wind but we know that it's cap so yeah i've just finished football but because i'm going back again at the gym what i'm having is just a quick sandwich the reason i'm having this after my football session is because I'm going back again at the gym so I don't want to be eating a bit too much and this has a lot of protein like the egg basically if you can see the egg and the bacon and because it's brown bread it will release slow energy of carbohydrates so by the time I get at the gym it will allow me to have enough energy to start my session Merci, merci. <laughs> yes. me being sat here is also part of my recovery so by the time i am at the gym uh, i've already digested this food and have my energy anyways yeah i'm watching the world cup go on argentina to win what i've got planned at the gym will be very intense so it's important that for me i try to stay very hydrated so i try to look so i look to drink about four of these glasses i love you bro this guy he's so underrated that last rep at the gym that last run at the gym is just for moments like these oh my god what a finish son drink after that goal i need a drink <laughs> this is my currently my third cup messi messi that's my guy The best World Cup. Maradona 86, Messi 2022. That's a great. Anyways, now I am off to the gym. Literally, I am so tired. But moments like this motivate me to keep going. So, of course, what I'm going to be doing at the gym will be intense. It's very important that I keep myself very fit. Anyways, the family, I'll see you soon at the gym. <laughs> Cheeks, I've been holding my breath, you're my side of relief, the side of my peace. Give me pause, Let's fucking have it, lads. <laughs> Dinner life. Now, this is my third session. With this third session, the main focus is to build my endurance and maintain that fitness level quite high as well because missing out some session, you could drop your fitness level quite a lot. And it's important that for me, I do a lot of 
things like this so on here I just start with like a quick warm-up I run about 3k and I look to perform this under 16 to 20 minutes and from there I move on to some high intensity training and the first phase is basically just running on the treadmill as fast as I can I mean the treadmill was going about 20 miles per hour that was the max for me but anyways on here I was just working for about 20 seconds off for 10 seconds doing the same thing again about 10 to 15 times then once I've done that I look to rest for about a good three minutes because I like to be in a training zone for me to see results when I'm training so the sort of things I do here now is just being in a training zone And I will do a lot of HIIT training, different type of HIIT training and I will perform each exercise for about 20 seconds then rest for like 10 seconds, do the same thing again 3 to 4 times then move to the next exercise. During this exercise as well, I try my best to work as hard as I can literally to see, to push myself to the max. That's the main goal there, to stay fit and see results. So I have to push myself. No one's going to do it for me my guy anyway, my, or my woman whoever's watching this with hit training it can be very very tough so it's also a mental game thing and for me i just love it it pushes me you know mentally and physically so for example when they start last five minutes of the game because i do things like this it just keep going i just keep going and going and i just feel unstoppable anyways that's the sort of things i do But yeah, now at this point, I've just finished my gym session and the gym was about to shut. He's filming, just so you know. Pardon? He's just filming. <laughs> Obviously, I didn't have time to have a quick shower or anything like that. So I'm going to be straightforward, let's get to the point. During the festive season, there's few things that I do to keep myself in top condition. Apart from working out, there's few things that I also do. So here I'm going to share with you 
some of my tips, the things that works for me. So it's up to you to try them. The first thing is food. Like, don't get me wrong, during the festive season, I love to eat, like just eat, eat, eat. But one thing I'd also look is just cut out the amount of food that I eat. I starve myself for like a good three to five hours. At the same time, it's important that I try not to put on weight. So with my food intake, I look to eat small portion. And on top of that, I reduce the amount of fat food that will, like I will eat um, certain fat food, but I will just cut it down. I will just take smaller portions, not eating too much of the bad food. I also look to reduce the amount of carbohydrate that I eat because carbohydrate is basically just provide you with energy. So eating a lot of carbohydrate and just being sat there won't help me. I will just end up put on weight and that's not what I want. So I reduce the amount of carbohydrate that I take. And that's the thing as well. After my gym sessions or my football training, I also look to eat food high in proteins because it will allow me to recover. For example, it could be eggs, fish, um, beef, you know, steak. I think that's the same thing. Food like that anyways. And I also try to drink milk. Now, let me talk to you about hydration. In terms of hydration, I look to drink maybe two to three liters of water a day. That's depending on how I also train. So obviously here, you saw how I was working quite intense at the gym. So it was, it was very important for me to just stay hydrated. Not only that, hydration improved my recovery and also reduced the chance of me get catching any cramps whilst I'm training. The thing about hydration as well is that it carries nutrients around my body. So those nutrients helps my body to recover really quick so I can train again. When it comes to training, I like to be in a training zone because that is, for example, let's say I'm working at the gym and I'm doing a hit session. I look to be at a high heart rate of 160 or above that because that's the training zone for me to pick and see results. So in that zone, my body is working really hard. The thing is, with training, I look to train for 45 to an hour and I focus mainly on quality, not quantity. So yes, I might have trained three times a day or maybe five times sometimes. They have done that before five times, but in this occasion, I train three times and for a five minute, for a five minute, for a five minutes, and I will get more result out of it. Not only that, I'm not putting a lot of stress on my body. So my body has time to recover. Another thing is sleep. So obviously during the festive season, it's quite hard to fall asleep and that is the thing i will nap for like 20 minutes or maybe half an hour and believe it or not it works for me so once i've done that i feel refreshed and i can engage more of the family when they're about you know just enjoy it for the time being i forgot to mention when it comes to hydration i also do not drink at all i don't drink so Obviously, I'm not saying do not drink. Please enjoy yourself during the festive season. And just remember your end goal. When it comes to alcohol, like just try your best to cut it down a bit if you can, because you will see so much results out of it. Because alcohol literally just shut down your organs and makes it hard for you to stay really fit. And for example, let's just say you've spent 45 minutes at the gym, like I just did and you find yourself just drinking 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 you're basically just putting back all those hours that you spend at the gym so what's the point of you going to the gym if you're gonna put it back in again with just drinking but for me i do not drink at all and what else motivation that's the thing when it comes to motivation yeah during the festive season because i want to be the best version of myself and the competition out there is huge so when everyone is just there having fun and enjoying themselves, for me, I'm like, yeah, this is my time to work harder. Because after those festive period, that is when I know I can perform better. Because at the back of my head, I'm thinking of the end result. So I'm gonna let this guy have fun. I wanna still work, work, work. When it's time to perform, I perform. And that's how during those moments, it will allow me to achieve my goals and ultimately everything i do at the back of my head i look at the long plan like the long-term goal so for example let's say here 
you want to lose weight what is the cause why do you want to lose weight are you trying to lose weight because you want to look good in a dress you want to impress your partner or like what is the main to, like what is the goal so for me i always like to have a goal like the end result like that's the end result i will try to put this in place to achieve that so for me trying to become a great footballer these are the sort of things i do really also for me to see results hit sessions for me is very important i look to do a hit session for like 15 to 20 minutes you know per session because that literally just burns so much fat like for example when you just sat at home you're just there chilling at home because you've just done that session it's constantly just burning fat burning fat and doing it three times a week will help me a lot and that's the sort of things i do during my festive season to stay really fit so just to wake up hydration food exercise sleep and motivation so that's the sort of things anyways i hope you enjoyed this video and you learned a few things from this video and if you find anything valuable from here give a thumbs up so i can reach out to other people you know youtube will literally just push my content out to more people and not only that it will also help grow my channel but anyways yeah if you're also new to the channel subscribe down below for more content like this let me tell you a little secret obviously i am just filming this video right now yeah but i've already just made a video i've made a video i've made a video i've made a video i made the video and then i just put it together work smart not hard this is <laughs>